This video is for helping users install a computer case fan. As always, when working inside your computer, turn it off, make sure it's unplugged, and that you're properly grounded to protect your computer from electric static discharge. After purchasing a case fan for your computer, the next step is to place the fan properly in the computer. As can be seen in this picture, for proper airflow, you should have colder air entering from the bottom front of the computer and blowing hot air from the back top of the computer. Here I'm screwing the case fan into the back of the computer. A case fan could either be a fan that requires no screws and snaps into the case, or a fan that has four screws that hold it in place as shown in this picture. Once the fan is securely in place, the next step would be to plug it in. The type of plug can vary depending upon the type of fan you have. Most case fans will have a three pin cable that plugs directly into the computer. Others may have a Molex connector that plugs into one of the available power supply connectors. Here I'm connecting the case fan to a three pin connector on the motherboard. Often many motherboards will have several of these connectors for each of the fans you have with your computer. For users who have a 3-pin cable but do not have an available connector on their motherboard, an adapter can be purchased that would allow the 3-pin connector to be connected to a Molux connector on the power supply. If your case fan is not working or you have other questions, please feel free to visit ComputerHope.com.